guys, this is Total Gamer 95 back with another tutorial, and this one we'll be focusing on uh, creating your own EXE files using those three uh, programs. Um, WinZip and WinRAR are the um, purchasable versions. I find them a lot easier to use than 7-Zip. WinRAR would probably be my favorite out of all of them. But 7-Zip is a good free alternative, and um, anyways, that's basically all I need to know. So if you're using WinZip, if you want to use WinZip, uh, I just go into the WinZip, and then I'm going to use my evaluation version, so you can use it on the evaluation version. Now what you're going to do is you're going to just select a folder, or a file, um, I'm probably just going to open like a picture, or put a picture somewhere or something. I'll just put this in. All right, so now uh, I'm gonna save it to my desktop. Um, well, actually, no, I can't. I'm just gonna save it to my documents then. Um, and then I'm gonna save it as um, pick zip. And make sure you save it as the legacy compression, and then just say add and then exit out of that now if you go back you're gonna see there it is um, that's the file now you're gonna go action make exe file or shift k now this is gonna say um, is, a, is a free add-on for registered WinZip users and because you're using an evaluation version blah 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 doesn't matter you can just click continue and then make sure that this up here is the um, zip you're going to make the exe file out of and then just say ok and then you don't want to test it now so just exit out of those and then now you have your self extract file you open that up say whatever it doesn't really matter and then you can say browse or whatever I'll just show you you can just put it on your desktop and say unzip and now it's there Now, let's say we wanted to focus on WinRAR. WinRAR is very easy. It's much easier um, than than uh, WinZip. All you have to do is I'm just going to create a new folder so it's easier. So it's on the desktop. Okay. Now you can just go. I can right click on this and say add to archive. Add to archive. Sorry. And if you don't have that option, you can just go into WinRAR and drag it onto it. Okay. And then now on this one, all you're going to have to do is say create SFX archive. And as you can see up here, it changes to EXE. Then you just click OK. And as you can see, now you have a self extracting WinRAR um, archive. And when you open it up, it brings this up and you can install it and so on and so forth now the next one we're going to do is 7-zip, I'm just going to delete this okay now on this one you just drag on to it and it'll bring up this and this one it's the same thing but instead it's on this side over here and as you can see create sfx archives and it changes it to exe I just click OK, and there it is. So, guys, that's how you create self-extracting EXE fi uh, files. Um, and I hope you guys like this tutorial. Comment, rate, subscribe. Please subscribe, guys. Just takes one little click. Um, I really want some more subscribers, guys. Uh, but comment, rate, subscribe, and thanks for watching.